Confluence whiteboards. You've probably seen the videos on it, but you're probably not seeing it inside of your Confluence. Well, if you want to know how to enable this beta, this video is gonna walk you through the exact steps that you gotta take in order to enable the Confluence whiteboards beta. How does your team articulate their thoughts and ideas? Did you know that a picture is worth a thousand words? Let me introduce you to our exclusive sponsor for our Confluence videos, Gliffy. With Gliffy for Confluence, you can effortlessly create stunning flowcharts, mind maps, wireframes, and so much more, all directly from within Confluence itself. No more jumping to a different application or dealing with clunky integrations. Check out the link in the description below and start a free trial of Gliffy today. Now keep in mind that Atlassian used to have a waiting list. They got rid of that. And so as of this week, they've enabled the whiteboards beta to everybody in the community. Now it's still free and I recommend that you use it. Atlassian's figuring out their pricing model still, but while it is in beta, I recommend that you go and try it out because it, is, it really is a cool feature that I think every team's gonna love. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing to the channel. Drop a like if you get value out of this video. And if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, let me know in the comment section down below. Now this video is gonna be quick. I'm just gonna basically show you the one, two step process here. It's super easy. It's not gonna be a super long video. So hopefully you can stick around for the whole thing and enjoy how to easy it is to enable this beta. Now I do have to start this video off by telling you, you will need to be a site level administrator to your Confluence or at least have Confluence admin rights because if you don't, then you're not gonna be able to enable this. This beta in order to turn it on is restricted to just your Confluence admins or your site admins. Now, once it's enabled, anybody in your team is gonna be able to use it, but to do the exact steps that I'm about to show you, you are gonna to need to be an administrator. Are you struggling to get your points across in a meeting? Have you tried showing your team a diagram instead? Glippy makes intuitive drag and drop diagramming software that helps teams of all types collaborate more effectively. Glippy's deep integrations with Confluence and Jira make it the leading Atlassian diagramming tool, allowing users to create everything from technical diagrams to scribing software architecture to basic mind maps to capture ideas. Give our friends over at Glippy some love and start a free trial using the link in the description down below. So assuming you are an administrator, you're gonna click on this gear up here in the top right corner and Confluence is a little weird. It actually doesn't give you a pop-up or anything like it does in Jira, but rather takes you to a like a settings page. But once you're there, you should see this beta feature section over here. Now, if you don't see it, please don't come at me in the comments. Atlassian is slowly but surely rolling this out. As I mentioned, this is something that just started coming out this week. I've tested this in a couple of different Confluences that I have access to. It's all there. So I'm keeping my fingers crossed that it's gonna be there for you as well. But you just click on this beta feature section. Once you're there, the whiteboards is gonna be the only one that's there. And I am keeping my fingers crossed that databases, which was also announced the same day that these whiteboards were announced. Hopefully that's gonna come out very, very soon because I am dying to use those databases. But anyways, all you're gonna wanna do is come here and you're gonna see an agreement down here. Now in this particular instance, I've already enabled it, but let me quickly switch over to a different Confluence so I can show you what that looks like. So yours is gonna look more like this. It's basically gonna think, tell you the things that you gotta know, which is once it's enabled, it's gonna take a few minutes, right? And that basically means is that in a couple of minutes, once you hit this blue agree and enable, your create button is going to change. It's gonna look like the one in my other videos where rather than it just being the create button, it's gonna have the little arrow that's gonna then allow you to create a whiteboard. So that's gonna go on there. There will be a short onboarding flow to introduce your whiteboards to all users. And that basically means is that the users are gonna see like that typical Atlassian guide where it like tells you to click here and click over here. And it just has you kind of following, playing the game of cat and mouse on your screen. So that's gonna be there. Uh, once it's enabled, you're not gonna be able to disable them. Uh, at least during the beta period. So that's basically something you're gonna have to accept and live with. Base admins can manage who can create and edit the whiteboards. We'll talk about that in a future video. And then certain Confluence features such as data residency and backup restore, it are not supported cur currently with the whiteboards during the beta period. So again, it is still in beta. Keep that in mind above all else. This is all beta. At last, you can change things at will in a heartbeat. So you are going to at a risk accept or not accept, right? If you don't want to, if this is all too scary for you and your organization, then you, you have no business enabling a beta because a beta is just that, it's a beta. There's a certain level of 
of trust and risk that you're accepting when you're going into a beta. And then certain third-party apps are just going to might be impacted. Uh, again, that action still working on and all that. So all you got to do, though, is, again, assuming that you're okay with everything that they just told you, is you're going to hit agree and enable, and that's it. Now it's going to look like mine. And if you wait a second, sometimes you just refresh your page, then you're going to see that you now have that little drop-down, and you're going to be able to create a whiteboard. Now, all you got to do at this point is go watch my other videos where I kind of walk you through how to use the whiteboards. Trust me, your team's really, really going to love this functionality. That's it for this video. Again, short and sweet, to the point, just showing you how to enable the whiteboards in case you didn't know how to do it. I'm sure your team, if you're an admin, I'm sure your team's either asking for it or if you're a user of Confluence and you are like, how do I get this? Well, now you know. Go share this video with your administrators and tell them, just follow this, click here, click there, and you got your whiteboards enabled. Is your team having a hard time collaborating? Then you need to try out Glippy for Confluence. Collaboration has never been easier. Glyphy for Confluence allows your team to work together in real time, making edits, providing feedback, and driving productivity. Say goodbye to version control headaches and hello to seamless teamwork. Show our sponsor the power of the internet and start a free trial to Glyphy for Confluence using the link in the description down below. That's it for this video. If you did find value out of this video, make sure you drop a like. And if you're watching this video and that subscriber count on my channel doesn't say over 10,000 subscribers, then I want to remind you that this video is part of the Summer of Atlassian 2.0, which means our goal is to try to hit 10,000 subscribers by the end of summer. So we can only do that if you take a second right now and click on that subscribe button down below. Make sure you check out the links in the description down below for all the different ways that you can help support the channel. Thanks, and I'll see you in the next one. I love the chase and the hunt and I set the pace when I'm running I always take what I want and I always give it 100 don't need